Hey guys, welcome back to the Hobby Farm Homestead. Uh, today's just going to be a short vlog. I just want to give you a couple things that have been going on around here. Uh, I made some pickles the other night. I didn't film that just because it's pickles. It's pretty easy and I just used a pre-mixed pack. Um, here's what's left. I had 12, 12 of these and the kids always give them to their friends because they love them. So, not much left, but I got a whole nother batch I got to do. So, I don't know, I'll probably have another 12 or 13 jars to make. So, these are the goat carts um, that my mom and dad bought the kids. This one's supposed to be at their house, um, but they brought it over here. So, and then that's the small one. This is double cedar. And the one over there we're still working on getting parts in slowly. It's kind of hard getting parts right now for these things just because this, everything's kind of slowed down a little bit. But it's got to get tires and a motor for this one and it'll be ready to go. So hopefully that'll happen. But uh, yeah, so we're going to go out here and feed the cows and then uh, see what else is going on. Now the feed man delivered our feed, but... He was supposed to put it in the garage and he kind of just put it right here, so. It's a disaster again, but I'm gonna grab some uh, cow feed. And then we'll go over there and feed those big old fat cows. Bed. Watch out, chickies. Turkeys are getting big. I know one, uh, one took off and chased my son last night. And <laughs> that scared him a little bit. But, you know, you got a big turkey chasing you. It's kind of, it's kind of scary. Alright, as soon as them cows see I'm over here, they're going to come running. Coming in. Other side. Yeah, they're getting big. These three Holsteins are getting pretty big. This 
little half breed or whatever you want to call them or hybrid it's like half Angus half Holstein I don't know if she'll get much bigger she'll put weight on but um, <clears throat> I don't know if her height and size will get much bigger but she'll definitely put the weight on so I'm get the hose here and get them some water <laughs> Yeah, the flies are pretty pretty hard on these guys. Alright. Ooh, that one ran into the board. See, chickens do a good job of uh, breaking down manure quite a bit. But I still got a big pile I gotta get spread. Coming up here, I gotta put a little bit more slats in the manure spreader. And as soon as we cut the second cutting off the field, We'll go ahead and get that all split. Or spread, I mean, sorry. But, uh, yeah, I guys want to show you on this high tensile fence. It requires a little bit of maintenance every year. You can kind of see, I don't know if you can see up that line. It's kind of sagging. But that's normal for this stuff. You just take that H handle and Put a couple clicks on that and you're in good shape um, and then as far as this stuff here poly tape you just get on the end and stretch it a little bit more but uh, needs a little bit of tightening not too much like I said a couple clicks and that's you know it's with anything that high tensile it stretches just like any other wire does and uh, you just got to keep tightening it up that's why you got to leave room on those ratchets to be able to tighten it over the years probably every two years it needs it uh, we've had some pretty good heat so that doesn't help it that'll allow it to stretch more so we'll go over and check out in the garden see how that's doing i've harvested most of the stuff out of there the thing left out there is pretty much beans and um the tomatoes hey duckies these guys just do whatever they want all day All right, let's check out this garden here. I think it's pretty close to getting the um, carrots done. This garden needs weeded so bad. But it's kind of getting overran. Well, we have like this acorn squash in here. It's just supposed to be butternut, but I don't know if we just got the wrong, wrong seed or what. And the zucchini. Oh, there's a big zucchini in there. That one needs picked. My wife just made zucchini bread today. Then the beans will be ready here soon. We got jalapenos. But the peppers, I mean, there's there's a lot more peppers on these plants. It's time for them to be picked again. Now I need to run the tiller in the, in this garden again. Yeah, there's probably another batch of peppers on these plants. Green peppers, you're ready to go. That's a pretty good green pepper. That one's ready. Oh yeah. And, oh, it's got a couple of them on it. Bad one, something got into it. I don't know the chickens or whatever take it. 
that grow. Tomatoes are looking pretty good. They just need to get uh, ripened up. Well, I need to get in here with the tiller for sure. This plant just never really did anything. And it does have one little squash on it. And this zucchini plant. I think they pretty much picked most of it. It's got a couple of them. Oh, no, it's got a lot of zucchinis. Yes, Dad, there's one after me. No, there isn't, bud. <laughs> He's scared to death now. Those turkeys are going to come after him. And then as far as pickles go, I'm sure there's a few more on here. Yeah, there's quite a few growing again. So, I'll have another harvest of those for sure. And the beans, they're growing. They'll be ready soon. Here, buddy, pick these peppers up over here. There's four of them. Take those in the house. There's one more over there. Dad. Yeah, it's got a, got like a tumor on it. It's not a tumor. <laughs> All right, grab that one more. For some reason, my legs. Are which one was tasting you? It might be Is it that this one. one? Yeah, I think it might be that one. I don't know. <laughs> it was pretty funny yesterday. He was he got pretty scared. But uh, that's pretty much the vlog for today. Um, not much going on. Got a big baseball game tonight. It's gonna be under the lights for my son. But uh, I'm gonna end this video here. I'll catch you guys later.